Let's talk about the maintenance and operation of your dishwasher. There are three key factors that play a role in the proper operation, performance, and cleaning process. Those three factors are water temperature, detergent, and the use of liquid rinse aid. Let's first talk about the water temperature. Let the hot water run for two to three minutes. Simply shut the water off and then start your dishwasher. This will result in the dishwasher receiving as hot a water possible for it to minimize the runtime and give the best cleaning performance that it can. We do not recommend the use of powdered detergents. No powdered detergent on the market in a dishwasher or a washing machine will dissolve 100%. The lack of dissolved detergents in the dishwasher can cause buildup, corrosion, and stench. We recommend the use of liquid detergents. The third factor that plays an important part in the proper operation and runtime of a dishwasher is the use of liquid rinse aid. Liquid rinse aid is designed to help raise water temperature, which minimizes the heating process time, and it also helps dry the dishes correctly. The detergent reservoir has a built-in canister for rinse aid. The canister has indicators that acknowledges when the detergent is empty. Some are electronic. Simply take the cap off the canister, pour the rinse aid in until it starts to come up out of the bleed hole. This will result in making certain that the canister is full and you won't have to fill it but once every three months. Most dishwashers have a removable filter that is designed to collect food and matter that falls off the plates that can't be drained through the wash system. It's recommended that that debris be removed from this filter at least once a week, which you can do underneath the sink tap by clearing it. One of the worst things that you can put into a dishwasher are bottles with papers left on the sides of them, like pickle jars. If you put jars like this in your dishwasher with the paper left on them, the paper can break down and it'll accumulate and build up in your wash arms. The spray arms in the unit, if they get built up with this debris, will not allow the unit to clean properly on the upper and lower racks. 